Hey out there, Cocoa Beans here, and welcome to another adventure in Stardew Valley. Today is the, uh, Tuesday, the second day of spring, and it is our second day in our grandpa's cottage. And look, all of our flowers are growing. Flowers? Plants. All of our plants are growing, and we have some mail, so uh, let's check the mail first. Um, there we go. Hello there! Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie! Oh! Um, okay. That's... That's doable, we can do that. Let's first go grab some water from our pond here. There we go. And then we've got to water all of our plants here to make sure they grow up nice and healthy so that we can um, sell them for market price and get lots of money so we can buy lots of things and build up our farm. How many plants do we have here now? Um, not too many. I think we should probably get some more, but I actually forgot to put stuff in the bin. Uh, last night, so I don't know if I explained this last time. I think the mayor Lewis, Mayor Lewis, went over it a little bit briefly. That um, at night, so uh, he'll come and he'll grab stuff out of that um, bin that's right over there on the right-hand side of the house. This one right over here. So if we put stuff in here, he'll come by and grab it, and then we can sell it. So let's put all this stuff. We're gonna keep this. We'll keep this, and we'll keep that. But uh, let's head on down. Should we head on down to the beach now? Let's try to... Let's actually do a little bit more work around here. Let's get rid of some of this stuff and just like clear some of this area so that we can have more room to plant things. Because we're going to need to plant lots of stuff so we can get lots of stuff, right? I'm going to have a big giant bean farm. <laughs> it's going to be awesome. So let's get rid of all this stuff. There's a little bit of extra wood here. Uh, let's see. There we go. Forgot how to get through my tools there for a second. Okay, and we need a pickaxe, and we'll get rid of these rocks. There we go, and we'll actually put all of this stuff in the bin also. Maybe not the rocks, actually. So, you can actually craft in this game. Uh, here's the crafting menu. So you can make fences, and gates, and chests, and torches, wood paths, gravel paths, and then cobblestone paths, and then a campfire. So this is what we can make now. And as we play the game, we should get, like, other recipes for things. What's this? I got a geode. You found a geode. The local blacksmith can break it open for you. Who knows what might be hidden inside. Oh, that's cool. It's like a secret. It's like a blind box, right? Or a blind bag, I guess. Let's go ahead and cut down this tree for now. Get rid of this one. Oh gosh, it takes so many hits with this axe. We need to, we need to upgrade our tools soon. Uh, we need to do a lot of things, I think. Uh, how did... Okay, I was stuck behind this plant, so let's go ahead and get rid of this plant here. And I'm going to get rid of this tree also, right here, just like that. There we go. So many hits with the axe. Come on, you can do it. There we go. And um, if you didn't know, so on the right-hand side there, you see that E, and there's like a yellow bar that's kind of halfway filled up. That is our um, energy, I guess. So we only have a certain amount of energy per day. And as we play we should be able to get more energy. So I think I may, I might be able to make a chest now. No, I need 50 wood. How much wood do I have? 39. Okay, I don't have enough wood to make a chest, but I do have some tree sap. We'll go ahead and collect some of that up. Oh, and there's some more wood. Do I have enough now? How much do I need again? 50 and I have 45. No, almost. You know what? Let's go ahead and instead of going out to the beach right away to meet uh, Willie, whoever that is, we are going to build a chest to start putting our things in because we need a, somewhere to store our stuff because we don't actually have that many item slots for how much stuff is in the game. Okay, um, what are these little dancy flowers here? Can I dig these? What if I do this? Nothing. Okay, um, we should be able to make our chest now and I would think, I think we should put our chest in our house, right? Yeah, let's put it, uh, let's put it up here next to the window. So there we go, there's our chest crafted and we'll put it right right there and for now we're gonna put in our sap and our seeds we'll hold on to our geode and we'll put this stuff in too because we might go out and see the blacksmith today although I'm not sure if we actually have enough money to um, to crack this open I think it costs money I think you have to pay the guy keep your eyeballs peeled for any um, secrets or surprises or like flowers and things that you can pick too because you can pick flowers and like wild uh, roots and things like that and they're sometimes uh, special and you get uh, special things or you can make special things I think there's there's stuff that grows in the wild that you can only grab um, 
that you can only grab during certain seasons. So right now it's springtime, so all the stuff that you can forage for and find on the ground, you can only find in spring. But I do see some worms over here. So you see these worms right here in front of me, all wiggling around? They hide secrets. So if you do that, see, we got a book. What does this mean? You found a lost book. The library's collection has expanded. So what that means is uh, there's a book in the library now. There's a library somewhere in the town. And we can uh, we can go there and actually read up on how to play and like it gives you tips and things like that. But uh, let's see, where am I going? I, I think he said the beach. I think the beach is this way if I remember correctly. So, all right, here we go. Well, this isn't the beach, but that must be Willie. Hey, Willie, did you have something for me? Willie. Willie. Oh, there he goes. Ahoy there, son. <laughs> Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Good to meet you too, Willie. You had something for me? Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. A month, jeez. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Oh, he bought a new fishing rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. Oh, sweet. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from my shop once in a while. Oh, I see. So he gives us a fishing pole, and then we, like, go buy bait and stuff from his shop right there behind us. You received a bamboo pole. How do I use it? Is he going to show me? There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. Ha ha. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say anyway. <laughs> Interesting fact. Fresh fish don't actually have a very strong smell. Hmm. Okay, so let's let's try this out. Let's grab our bamboo pole and can I well, here we go. That was a that was a weak cast. Let's try that again. It didn't go that much farther. I don't know how to catch fish, so I guess I'm gonna just start pressing buttons soon. There we go. Button. That didn't work. I'm guessing I press. I pr I tried pressing A, and I don't think that worked. So I think I'm gonna try to press X this time and see what happens. Come on, fishy bite. Here, fishy, fishy. Fishy? There it goes. It didn't work again. Maybe I press a different button? I'm going to keep trying. I'm going to try... I'm going to try B this time. We're going to catch a fish, guys. B doesn't feel right. B is always like the cancel button on the Xbox, right? Maybe I'm... Maybe I'm doing it too soon or something? Or not... Or too late? Come on, fishy. Uh oh, we're almost out of energy, too. Okay. Alright, I give up. I'm terrible at fishing. We'll try again another time. Uh, oh, a seagull. It's pretty. It's a pretty seagull. It's a slow seagull. So this is the beach. And look, here's clams. So you can find clams and, like, um, other things on the beach. Oh, there's a guy. Oh, we gotta meet people, don't we? Hey, come here, guy. No, come back. Hello, I'm new. Ah, the new farmer. We've all expect we've all been expecting. And whose arrival has sparked many conversation? Elliot. Does he live on the beach? I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you too. Yeah, he must live in here. It's locked. Only Elliot's friends can enter. Hmm. There's a question mark here. Hmm. With three hundred pieces of wood, this can be fixed. I think that's a clue. I think it's telling me if I go there with three hundred pieces of wood. That I could uh, I could fix it and open up that new area. So let's go ahead and explore around a little bit. I think the is this the guy I met last time? I think it is. Let's talk to him. Oh hi, it's good to see you again. Yeah, that was Sam. Oh here's some kids. Let's talk to these guys. Oh a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. That's right. Never talk to strangers, kids. Dot dot dot. Hi. Hello. I'm tutoring Vincent and Jess today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Hi, Penny. That's very nice of you, Penny. 
That's very nice. Maybe I'm gonna bring you a flower next time I find one. Uh, what's this place? Is this, oh, this is the library. Here's the books we found. Tips on farming. Use fertilizer. Fruit trees take a whole season. Crops will die as soon as the new season starts. Oh, and there's a book missing here. Can I... Oh, there we go. This is a book by Marnie. Animals are very sensitive. They like to be pet every day and prefer to eat grass outdoors than dry hay. They don't like being outside in the rain, though happy animals produce higher quality. Hmm. Can I meet you? If I talk to you, does that count as meeting you? It does. Gunther! It doesn't seem like you have anything to donate to the museum. Better get out there and, and treasure hunt. Huh? Or keep on treasure hunting. So, you can... That's right. So, if you find cool stuff, you can donate it to the museum. This is the museum here, and they'll put it in here, and then it'll, like, tell you information about it. And I think you get rewards for, uh... Every time you bring in a certain amount of stuff, like every five or every ten or something like that. I think it might be every ten. No, every five, I mean. I think every five things that you bring in and donate to the museum, you get a special prize. So, uh... Let's keep walking this way. Okay, here's the blacksmith. And it's locked. It's closed at 4. Oh, it closed almost an hour ago. It's 4.50 in the evening already. Gosh, it's getting late. All we did was walk across town. Uh, what's this place? Joja Mart. Hey, this is the place that I used to work. I used to work for Joja. Can we talk to this person? No, they just want to sell us stuff. A cola light and parsnip seeds. Those parsnip seeds are more expensive. Can I introduce myself to you? I guess not. Okay, join us! Thrive! Look at this guy. Morris. Welcome to Joja Mart! How are you doing today? I don't believe we've met. I'm Morris Joja, Customer Satisfaction Representative. When you decide you want to become a Joja member, I'll be delighted to help make your transition a joyous experience. Um, okay. Is there anyone in here shopping that we can meet? There's nobody even in here. Fresh and cheap. <laughs> Good slogan. Fresh and cheap. I like that. Alright, let's go on and get out of here. I'm not sure if I can run. Like, is there a run button? I'm just pressing buttons now. No. <laughs> that was a bad place to fish, I think. So, let's see what's up this way. Just explore around our map a little bit. Explore around Stardew Valley. Um, nothing this way. Looks like we can go this way. And where does this take us? I don't see any, like, I have my eyes peeled for flowers and, and roots and all those things. Berries. Oh, there's a flower right there. I, I was going to say I hadn't seen any. What's this place? Here's another flower. Um, let's, Pelican Town. Let's go in here. It's locked. Okay. What's all this stuff? Anything cool in here? Uh, it doesn't look like it. It's just more of this, uh, what is it? Fodder, I think it's, is it fodder? No, fiber? What is this stuff? Fiber, yeah. Oh, there's a playground up here. Hmm, a fountain. Oh, there's another flower. Let's pick it. Here we go. Three flowers now. And I think I might keep these as gifts to people. I'm going to start giving these out. Alright, so uh, this will take us right back home, I think. And I think I saw in our farm a way that we can go, like, up somewhere. So let's go explore that real quick. Um, I think maybe we should have bought more seeds, huh? We have a couple more seeds here. They're like the random seeds. So let's we'll go ahead and plant those right there and right there. How many do we have? Do we have two or three? I can't tell. Two. There we go. We had two of them. Yeah, I think over this way, there was a place we could go up here. Yeah, up this way. Can I, can I get through here? Let me get out my, my thing. There we go. What's this called? Like a scythe, I think? Alright, so there totally is a place up here. It is getting dark though, so that's scary. I don't know if... I don't think... I don't think bad guys come out at night. But you never know. So... Oh, what's this place? Does it say? It's locked. Okay, it closed at 8. Um... I guess we'll keep going around over here. There's got to be more people around here we can meet. I mean, not everybody's going to leave it. There's a camp? There's like a tent and a campfire over here. Can we? We can. We can turn the campfire off. That's awesome. Okay, let's turn it back on for whoever this is. Maybe its owner will come back. There's a thing over here. Don't know what that was. 
like a statue or something. And, uh, hey, buddy. What's, uh, here, let me, you need help? Here you go. Looks like that's blocked out of the way. So there's probably something we're going to have to do before we can uh, get through that way. Because it's blocked off for now. Kind of like the, the wood thing at the beach where you need a certain amount of wood. But we'll see. Okay, did I water the plant, the seeds that I planted? I don't remember if I did. It's getting really dark now. Okay, we definitely need to get back home. Oh, I don't remember where home is. Oh, no. I'm lost. Is it this way? This is back in the town. Okay, but I do remember that our farm is uh, over to the left here. So we'll go ahead and go back home. And I think we'll go right to bed. I think we're good. Oh, we'll put some of the stuff. We could put these uh, clams maybe in the in the um in the bin so that we can make a little bit of money on it tomorrow. All right, here we go. We'll go ahead and put uh the clams in there. And I'm going to keep I think I'm going to keep the daffodils and we'll put this in there and we'll keep the geode cuz it might have something cool inside. We got to crack it open. Um the rest of this stuff can go in our chest. This this and this. Uh oh, there's some more seeds. Yeah, we'll definitely use that. Let's put those seeds down. And uh, it's 1040 at night. I don't know what, I, I don't know if you just like fall asleep at a certain time or if you could just be out all night because the, my energy bar, it only goes down when I actually like work and do stuff, right? So there we go. And I'm going to have to water these. So water that one and this one. Oh, it looks like I didn't water the other ones too. There and there. And we're just going to fill this back up. There we go. And then we're off to bed. And we'll see how much money we've made on all of our uh, little things we put in our bin. This is so exciting. Okay. Go to sleep for the night. Yes. That is what we want to do. Second of spring. Year one. A hundred dollars for the um, shells. A um, hundred for the other stuff for two hundred dollars. Cool. We can buy like way more beans now. How many more beans can we buy? Like three or four? I think we can get three. Third of spring. Ah, huh. let's watch some TV in the morning. Let's see. Let's check the weather report. What do we got? Um, says it's gonna be sunny all day today. Or was that today or tomorrow? No, not today because it's raining today. Oh, we have more mail. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff, but my backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's General Store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Oh, uh, so I guess that's this. Oh, yeah. See, look, we have 12, the top row. And I guess if you can upgrade it and get the other rows, too. Um, yeah, we definitely have to do some more planting today, especially since it's raining. Because since it's raining, right, we don't have to water anything. So we actually save a lot of um, energy and time and stuff. So let's hurry up and see if we can get some uh, get some seeds here. I'm not sure what time this place opens, though. What time do you open? I bet you it's going to be closed. Yeah. It, oh, it's closed today. We got to go. To, uh, I bet Jojo Mart's open. We'll go ahead and go to the Jojo Mart and we'll get stuff there. That'll work. Look, dog. I don't see a dog. Hmm. No doggo. Jojo Mart was, I think it was up this way. Yeah, and across here. It's around here somewhere. Here it is. We found it. Jojo Mart. Is Jojo Mart open? It's locked. It opens at 9. Hmm. Okay. Well, I guess there's there's other stuff in town we can do till 9 o'clock, right? Like, go here. It's locked, too. It opens at 9. <laughs> is there people's houses we can go visit? I saw some houses in the town over here. Um, yeah, we could probably visit those. Because we still have to actually talk to everybody. Okay, they're locked. <laughs> is everything locked? We totally left our farm like too early. Well, let's go to the beach and see if there's more stuff that we can grab for some more money. What's this? Is this a thing? That's not a thing. I just watered it. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. Oh, you know what? Maybe we can do some fishing while we wait. Can we? You think we can catch some fish here in the surf? There we go. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. We might be too close to shore. 
Fishy, fishy, fishy. Fishy. No, you know what? It's raining. The fish don't like the fish don't like it to get wet. So they're probably like hiding in their homes or something. They don't want to get rained on. I don't know why we're walking around here in the rain, to be honest. Is it... Okay, it's 8.30. That means I can go in here now, right? Yes. Good morning. Good morning, Lewis. So, how was your first night in the old cottage? It was stinky. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed. But I think deep down, he actually loved that house. I think he did too. That's why he gave it to me. Because I'm his favorite grandson. Well, I was. He's not around anymore. Now I'm sad. <laughs> Poor grandpa. Uh, okay, Joja Mart. Joja Mart is this way, and it's 9 o'clock, so it should be open now. So let's hurry and run and get... Oh, here's a new guy. Come here, new guy. I need to meet you. No. Oh, I disappeared through the door. Here. Yes. Shane's hard, hard at work. He doesn't seem interested in talking. I want to meet you. No, uh, I caught him bef Darn it. I didn't catch him before he went to work. Okay, so, yes, seeds. Bean starters. We're going to need a couple of these. Oh, we don't have enough for another one. Let's get... We only had enough for two beans. Two beans and two parsnips. There we go. We're going to use the parsnips to buy more beans. Once we, uh, once we grow them. So let's get over here. What I really want to get get to is I want to get to um, get to the point where we have animals I don't like I, farming's great and all that stuff but I really like taking care of the little the little uh, chickadees and stuff chick you can get like chickens and and ducks and all kinds of stuff energy tonic and muscle remedy you figure the people behind the counter who I don't know I oh, can't go in there who I don't know you'd figure I'd be able to like say hello to them right I know they're working I get it but I can you can still introduce yourself when someone's at work, right? I think I've probably done that before. Like, oh, hi, I'm this person. I know you're at work, but I'm talking to you anyway. That happens. That happens all the time, I think. I think I saw that happen today when I was in the grocery store. All right, here we go. So let's uh, let's go ahead and fish that. That was wrong. <laughs> let's go ahead and put this here. And I don't think I want to go any farther this way. So we'll put a parsnip here and another parsnip here. And then we have two more beans Let's see. Let's put a bean. Um, again, I don't want to surround this whole thing. I want to be able to get to everything. So let's uh, let's just start another row. Let's go here and here, and we'll put a bean here and a bean right next to it. There we go. Okay, and uh, we have a bunch of le energy left today. So I guess we'll just start. Um, we'll start like clearing all this area and chopping down the trees and stuff, right? We'll use our scythe first. We'll get rid of all these bushes and stuff, and we can actually sell these things as as fiber. And I think we can use them to craft stuff, too, if I'm not mistaken. Can I shake this bush? I can. Is there anything in the bush? No. Can I shake the tree? Oh, I can. Nothing in the tree, either. Anything in this tree? This one? No. Okay. So let's clear this stuff. There's something poke... There's, like, little things poking out of the ground. Do you see these? Can I... Can I grab those? No, I just get rid of them. I think they're like uh, tree seeds, I guess, that are starting to grow. So we'll go ahead and get rid of those. And I think I'm just going to get rid of like the tops of the trees for now. And then I'll leave the stumps till next time. till I come back and uh, and we'll do that. So let's start, uh, let's clear this ground. I think this, I think that big stump over here to the right, I don't think we're going to be able to take that down. No, your axe isn't strong enough to break through this stump. Yeah. So we're going to have to get an axe upgrade before we can do that. And I'm going to leave these little trees here to grow, I think. We'll go ahead and get rid of these rocks. What happened? Whoa, it was like super frozen there for a second. That's weird. That was really weird. There we go. And this rock, we'll pick up all this, all this delicious wood and tree sap. And I think with the wood and tree sap... I think you can make torches. I think that's what the... Let's see. Is that the recipe for torches? Yeah. Wood and tree sap. So we can make torches now, which will be, um, which will probably be handy. Go ahead and take away this one, too. And we can actually make fences. I don't know if I want to start making fences and paths and things, because I'm not sure... I'm not sure what the layout is going to be yet. But I figure I want... I'd want paths. I don't have animals yet, so I don't think I need... I don't think I really need, like, a fences to keep animals out because I don't I don't know what the fences would do but um we can make paths so we have some rocks and some wood 
Um, I like the way I think I, I like the way the cobblestone looks, but I have more wood right now. I would have to collect more stone. So let's uh, let's make a couple of these, and we're just gonna box in our uh, our little farm plot here. So I think uh, this should probably be enough. And we're just gonna go around this. We'll go one right here. There we go, and we'll go all the way around. Look at that, that looks nice. We'll have a little pathway. Just like this, and then we'll um, we'll have one going this way. There we go. And maybe later on we'll uh, switch this out for, for um, cobblestone or gravel or something like that. I think uh, like this. Well, I guess we'll have to do this. Oh, look, you can actually put it on the grass. I didn't know that. Here, get rid of that one, that one, and this one, and we'll put it on the grass right here. Let me go back to where they are. Yes, look at our farm. Our farm is amazing. Our farm is the best farm I've ever farmed. And we'll go around this way. I think I'm going to need some more of these, though. But I do have a little bit of wood left, I think. I have eight wood left. We'll go ahead and make the rest. There we go. And then I'm just going to collect up these. This one, and this one, and this one. And maybe we'll get rid of some of these stumps, too, because we still have a pretty good amount of energy. And the stumps do give you a pretty good amount of, uh, of wood. So, there we go. And one more. Yeah. They gave you around five wood each. And we're just going to encircle this like that. And we don't really have enough um, stamina, I think, to be able to water all this whole area right now. But I think it looks good. I think it's nice. So uh, we'll start building it this way. And then when we do have enough stamina to farm this whole uh, area every day, because you have to water it every day, right? So you have to make sure you have enough stamina for that. And you actually, you build up stamina. So like the more things you plant and the more um, ground you hoe and things like that, the more um, you actually earn experience and levels and things like that. And you'll get up to levels and then you can, you can pick um, different like, I guess, paths. So like, uh, for instance, I think at one point you can pick to either be a farmer or like a, a rancher. So if you pick being a farmer, you get more money for vegetables. But if you pick a rancher, then you get more money for um, animal products and things like that. And with the animal products, it's really cool. So you can get you can make milk, but then you can get like a cheese maker and put the milk in there. And then the cheese maker um, makes it into cheese and then it's like worth more money. Right, so you can do you can do stuff like that. It's really cool. Um, the same for chickens. I think you can make mayonnaise, and you can take vegetables and f make pickles, and you can make um, jam, and uh, and you can make drinks and all kinds of things like that. Uh, you can have a beehive and make honey. It's really cool. There's like all kinds of things you can do. So let's go ahead and put our uh, all of our extra stuff in here, so we can get a little extra money. I'm gonna hold on to this stuff. There we go, and we'll put this right here back into our chest, so we can keep collecting all of that. And um, and I think that's about it. I think that's about all we have time for today. So we've um, we've built up our farm a little bit. We've got more stuff growing. I'd really like to section this out more um, once we get a little bit more uh, stable and a little bit more money, so that we can uh, have like you know beans over here, and then like parsnips will be over here. And then we'll do other stuff on this side, and we can like section it all out. I think that would be really cool. And I kind of like the path, the way the paths look. I thought I would like the gravel paths better, but I think these wood paths look really nice. And we might put a, we might end up putting a fence around this. I'm not sure yet. And I think, can we make a scarecrow? I think at one point you can make scarecrows because um, crows will come and eat your crops. But yes, that is it for this episode. Please join me again for the next episode. And remember, don't take any wooden nickels. Goodbye.